This is Jerry with Jerry's Retirement Wisdom. Got a little project here today where we're going to clean up some outdoor furniture that's starting to look uh, a bit dirty and worn. Not sure if that's a mold or just dirt from the highway nearby. So what we're going to do is we're going to fire up our Honda pressure washer and we're going to give those a good cleaning and see if we can't clean them up. And if you've never used a pressure washer, it's possible to mix your soap and water uh, on the pressure washer. But today we've just got a bucket here with some uh, bleach, a little bit of soap, and a soft brush. And I'm just going to pre-treat this a little bit just to maybe loosen that up a bit before we start pressure washing. The chairs don't seem to be dirty underneath. They just seem to have a bit of dirt up here on top. And I think mostly what it is, is we live on a busy corner. And I think they're just gathering some dirt where the dirt settles with the dew. So to use a pressure washer, we need to check that we've got fuel in our gas powered pressure washer, and we do. And the back here is where you hook up your water line to your pressure washer. It has basically a water hose fitting, so no tools are really required. We're just gonna screw that onto our pressure washer. There we go. The right item needs screwed on here in the back is our pressure wand. The hose fitting is back here with the water hose fitting, and it's a hand tighten hose as well. We'll get that tightened and then I'm going to turn this around As you can see here on the side we have the choke engine on and off and this little valve right here is our fuel line so now the fuel is on we're ready to get started I'm going to go turn our water on so we've got water turned on to our pressure washer and we're all gassed up, fueled up and ready to go. All we need to do is make sure our gas is turned on, pull the choke and move the on off switch to the on position. Another thing to note with the pressure washer is we have four tips for our wand. Use a different tip for the job you want. Today we don't want to we don't want to use a pressure that's very strong because if we could tear the fabric on our lawn chairs here, if we were cleaning concrete or something, we might use a different tip. So let's get this thing started.
This has been Jerry with Jerry's Retirement Wisdom. We've been pressure washing our lawn furniture from our back deck. And uh, I think we've got them cleaned up pretty well here. If you like our videos, be sure to like and subscribe. And we'll keep those videos coming. We'll see you next time.